Good evening, everyone. My name is James Gaddis. I'm an actor and TV presenter. I'm here tonight to explore a theory, and I'm grateful to everyone for coming along and taking part in this experiment. A year or so ago... You can expect a faithful retelling of the Bram Stoker original interspersed with the narrator's own journey through the story and how the material takes over him and how his obsession for the material kind of impacts upon his own life. And then it was like... A red cloud, the colour of blood, came over my eyes, and before I knew what I was doing, I was saying, Come in, Lord and Master, and he slid through the sash, though it were open only an inch. James is a bit crazy, and so the room needed to feel a bit crazy, <laughs> but in a Victorian way. <laughs> because he'd become so obsessed with finding out the truth about Dracula, that he sort of immersed in that time period. The role of my illusions in this show is to help you question what is real and what is not, and we want it to give a real ambivalence to the effect. So it could be the wind blowing, or it could be a ghostly presence in the room. Um, you'll never know, uh, that's the joy of it. So yeah, so all the effects are designed to put questions in your minds. Bells chiming. Midnight. Again. A bright light coming through the trees. A figure closer, closer, coming toward me. So we are thrilled we've uh, we started our tour of Dracula with the Full House uh, at the Beck Theatre in Hayes tonight and we toured to 32 venues around the country. Uh, it's going to be a thrill ride for the audience as a real insight into what could be true, what may not be true about the story of Dracula. Our lead actor James is, uh, is giving an energetic performance that's going to really delight audiences. We can't wait for you to come and see us.